Welcome to Royal News Updates. OMG. Angry Queen punishes Sussexes, Harry and Meghan's royal battle backfired, begging Queen's mercy. Before we start, please, subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon, thanks. Prince Harry has been scolded by Kay Burley after his High Court legal battle over police protection had its first hearing. The first hearing in the Duke of Sussex's claim against a Home Office decision not to allow him to pay for police protection for himself and his family while in the UK took place at the High Court on Friday. But Sky presenter Kay Burley suggested the Queen, 95, already has enough on her plate. The Sky host, tweeted, Oh Harry, is your grandmother not having to deal with enough, young man? Ms. Burley's post comes in the wake of Prince Andrew's civil sex assault case and the alleged cash for honours scandal that has engulfed Prince Charles's foundation. Another breaking news. Prince Charles and Prince William working together to slim down monarchy, says Source. Prince Charles and Prince William hope that having less people means less drama for the monarchy as they plot to slim down the firm together, according to a royal insider. Prince Charles and Prince William are working on a plan to slim down the monarchy in the future as less people means less drama, according to a royal insider. The revelation comes as the father and son have reportedly discussed their plans for when they both ascend the throne. According a source speaking to the US magazine this week, the pair have agreed to guide each other in their mission to reform the royal family, so that it resembles a smaller European-style institution made up of fewer members. The Duke of Cambridge is reportedly excited about this new chapter in his life and the challenges he'll be facing. William is second in line to the throne after the his father, who is said to be confident his son knows what he's doing but will ensure that his son is up to speed the ins and outs of the royal family on a deeper level. Earlier this month, Queen Elizabeth II celebrated her platinum jubilee marking 70 years on the throne. The longest reigning monarch made a huge announcement about the future of the throne on her big day. She said, when, in the fullness of time, my son Charles becomes king, I know you will give him and his wife, Camilla, the same support that you have given me. And it is my sincere wish that, when that time comes, Camilla will be known as Queen Consort as she continues her own loyal service. Charles and Camilla married in 2005, with the future king said to be over the moon following the announcement. There are no suggestions the coronation will happen soon, despite a recent Covid scare where Charles, who has caught the virus for a second time, came in close contact with his mother days before testing positive. The monarch has spoken about how her life was dedicated to service and there are no signs she'll step down anytime soon. Behind the scenes for when the day eventually comes, plans are underway for the event which will take place within 12 months of Charles' accession. Thanks for watching, please, share your thoughts in the comment. Thanks. Subscribe to our channel.